Good morning, my students. Are you ready for the lesson for today? Today we have new sound. We have two sounds. Okay, so our learning outcomes for today, we are going to first to review the previous sounds. Then we are going to recognize the new sounds and write them. And then we are going to identify the tricky words. Tricky words? What does it mean, tricky words? You will know later. Okay, now, can you say this sound? Can you name these sounds? Yes, my students, what is it? S excellent, what about this? Mm, very good, huh? J -j 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 -j. Well done. Oh. Eh, excellent. G uh -huh. Oh, well done. Ah. T. Mm. E. P. B. E. R. Mm. K. K. A. R. D -d 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 -d. Well done, my students. Now, let's have the new sound. Listen to the story. One day, Zainab went to her garden. She was very happy. She saw many flowers and she saw many bees. The bees buzz. It makes the sound zzzz. Zainab imitates, imitated the bee and it put her hands like this. Zzz. So today we have this sound. Zzz. Let's hear the song for the sound. Zzz. Listen. Okay, listen. Buzz. Can we write the sound? Z. We will start from line number two till three, like this: cross, down, cross. Again, cross, down, cross. Z. Can you write it down on your booklet, on your Jolly Phonics booklet? First, make circle for the sound z in this word and try to read them. Zebra, buzz, zoo, zip, fizzy. Okay. Now, please write down the sound z here. Now, let's read some words with the sound z. Look here. What is the first sound? Z. What is the second one? E. Excellent. What is the last one? Huh. Now, can you read th this word? Zip. Well done. What does it mean, zip? Look at the picture. Yes, this is zip. What is it? Zip. Zip. Okay. Now, let's read this word. Okay. Look here. This is z. And here. We have the sound O. Okay, so how many sounds in this word? Two sound Z and O. Let's read it now. Zoo. What is it? Zoo. What does it mean, zoo, teacher? Look at the picture. This is zoo. When, where we can find the animals. This is zoo. What is it? Zoo. Very good. Now let's have this game. I will turn this one and you are going to read the word. Okay, my students? Let's see. What happened? Okay. Okay. 
sorry, just a minute. Can you read this word? Fun, well done, okay. Huh. Run, excellent. Okay, now the third one. Egg, well done my students, excellent. Great job. Man, very good. Now let's move to the second sound. Look here, listen to the story. One day there was an old man went to the village. He took his umbrella with him because he saw too many clouds on the sky. Suddenly, there was a very big, strong wind came. Okay, and the wind took the umbrella up and up and up. Okay, so today we have the sound Wah. We have the sound Wah. Okay, now listen to the song for the sound Wah. For the sound Wah. Okay, listen. have the sound wah okay now how can we write the sound wah my students first i want you to make circle for the sound wah in this word and then we will write the sound wah okay i will show you how can we write the sound wah we will start from line number two till three like this it's very easy down up down up down up down, up. This is the sound wa. We have the sound wa. Again, down, down, up, down, up. This is the sound wa. Can you write it down, my students? Very good. Now let's read this word together. Let's read this word. Okay. What is the first one? What is the first sound wa? The second one, what is the second sound? Here we have one sound, it is or. Okay, so we have what? Then we have or. We have or. Okay, my students. Then we have mm. Now, can you read the word? Warm. Well done. Warm. Excellent. Now, let's see the tricky words. What are the tricky words? Tricky words are the words that we are write them in another, uh, in a way and read them in another way. For example, the word the. If you say ta ha e, you will say the word, this is the word ta he. No. It is not read, uh, we cannot read it like this. This word is the. This word is the. Kalimat mukhadi'a. Tuktab bitariqa wa tuntaq bitariqa ukhra. Okay, so we have to read them and memorize them like this. The. Okay, and here we have the word I. We have the word I. What does it mean, I? For example, I say, I am Layla. I am a girl, I am uh, 12 years old, so I, I, Anna, well done. Okay, look here, I am Biff, I am Maha, I, I use the word I when I talk about myself, I am, I. Here we have the word the, what does it mean the, for example, you say the chair, the sun, and ashams, al kursi. So the means al tarif, okay? The. What is it? 
the. What is it? The. Here we have the word me. Also, it is a tricky word. Give me a book. Give me. So this is me. And also we have the, the last word for today. She. She. It is used for girl. She. For example, instead of saying Layla, Layla went to the souk. Layla, Layla went to. Uh, Layla bought some books. Layla, Layla. Instead of saying Layla, 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 we use the word she. We use the word she. She is a teacher. She is Maha. Okay. She. She. So this is the word she. Now can you write down the tricky words that we that we studied for today? Yes, my students. Can you write I? Yes, teacher, so it will be written like this. I, can you write the? Can you write the? Yes, it will be written like this. The, excellent. The, can you write me? Me, yes. Me, me, okay. And also the word she. She, it will be written like this, she, okay, so here we have I, the, me, she, okay, that's all for today, thank you, goodbye.